Hello everyone, I'm Trestic44, all soon is fly, and welcome to this Let's Play of War Tales. Last episode, we made our way over to the Arena of Legends and gave it a try, and actually managed to succeed at the first one, at the first round. Huzzah! We are actually quite successful, and we can do another one, which we are going to. But, before we do, I have something to mention. A couple of days before this episode was... Now, I've been playing this game for over half a year, and I've got basically one region left to com left to go to and complete. And it's like, I'm almost done. I'm almost done with this game, and I can move on to another. A few days before this uh, episode is being recorded, they announced the DLC for this game is coming out. And it's coming out on the day that this episode is being released. Yes, that's how far back my uh, backlog is. At least I think it's the day this is being released. It might be tomorrow. Regardless, point is, massive new region involving pirates. I'm going to get to that eventually. <laughs> Although I have another region to go through in two weeks to get through first. Oh, that'll be a thing to deal with. But, right now we have the Arena of Legends... So let's see if we can do the second round here. It's gonna be a little trickier since, uh, from what I remember, the group is a you little different. Reputation to challenge the fourth league of Champ Critical requirements. Smart. A legionary joins the opponent's group every time a requirement from the crowd is failed. We're going to need to try to complete those requirements. Failing a requirement heals all enemy units for 20% of their maximum health. And Vapor Pool is spread throughout the arena, improve opponents at the start of each round. And the second one is going to be a, do a twofer. Okay, we'll see if we can give this a try, shall we? Um, I am considering changing these a little. Alarin's still useful. Fly and Argoon are still some of our best. Austin Gone is level 10. Don't recall shot in a regular shot, which is pretty nice, but hmm. Who else is level 10? Yeah, he's the only other level 10 we have. Well, and Gurlin, but Gurlin's not really a good choice. And these guys are all level 10. You know, because of the group we're going up against, I'm actually having second thoughts right now. Having Nelligrit might actually be useful, because Nelligrit would be able to attack twice. Plus, Liberator does help out. And her strength is... Freaking incredible. Holy crap. Um. Rufus is also pretty good. No, actually, yeah. Nelligrit is doing 72 damage, which is freaking amazing. The controlled whirlwind isn't it good. I don't know. You know what? Let's give it a try and see how this goes. I don't know how well it's going to go, but we're going to try. Alani must not move. All right, then. So Alani's not going to be able to do too much. You, at least, can do a massive amount of damage to Smart. And fall back a bit. Now he's gonna go next. Damage to the target consumes all poisons. That's fine. Removes all the guard. And a free attack. And give a slash. And go ahead and taunt. Consumes all poison, but that did basically nothing. Okay. I got an idea. You are not going to move, but you are going to smoke screen. 
gives another free hit. And our goon, you are going to get his attention. Wham. Bam. No thank you, ma'am, but you can survive a hit. That's a good amount of damage. All companions must move. Okay. We can do that. And you have a good amount of damage. So head over to here. Massive amount. Now fall back. And a smoke screen. He's going to die. That's basically a given. In fact, Fly, you head over to here. Destabilizing. And the slice will finish him off. Okay. First one is down. Wasn't a problem. Now we've got the new ones coming in, and yeah, these guys are going to be tough. Must end their turn next to an enemy. I'm not going to be able to do that, really. Especially because... I want to ensure that these two run into us. So do a load of damage. And set up this. Not quite where I wanted. Ow. That is bad. Okay, this is actually going to be a lot tougher than I thought. Okay, the Legionaries are actually relatively weak. That's actually not as much of a problem. <sighs> okay. Fly, I want you to engage this guy and get him there. And taunt him. Now, he can't do anything except smack you. Which did free you. Free him. Kogo's target. Not exactly the best, but that's fine. You might be able to smack them both. You can. Alright, wham. And a bam. Not the best, but it is still something. Now, fall back. Okay, you are engaged. <clears throat> I am fine with that engage. In fact, I can make use of this. Not the best. Ooh, burning. Actually, burning would be nice. And... This'll do. Very nice. Throw this in. Disengaged, free attack, which did a lot. Now fall back as far as you can. Engaged again, that's perfectly fine. He's almost dead. He's dead, perfect. Now, our goon must not take any damage. We can do that. Alarin, your Kogo's target. That legionary would be able to reach you, which I don't like. And Kogo would be able to reach you wherever. Okay, the legionary probably isn't that bad. So, what we need to do... Falai, you are going to engage. And make sure that he stays on you. Come on. There we go. And weakening again. 
All right, Alarn is gonna be shot, but he'll be fine. We'll just need to keep him far away, if at all possible. If you disengage, he's going to be able to get an attack, which won't do too much, but it will do more than I'd like. Kogo is still going after Alarin. Alright, Alani, you... Alright, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna smoke screen there. Okay, he's dead. That's good. Without much other option, you're going to be attacked. So you're going to Torch Strike him to do some damage. And Behadite Sanction does a lot of damage. Almost dead! Ah, so close! Oh dear god, Alani! So the good news is he's gone. Vapor Pool is spread throughout the arena improve opponents at the start of each round. Lisbeth must be engaged in combat at the end of the round. I can work on that. Lisbeth is going to go for Alani almost certainly. Gain stimulated increases damage to engaged units by 100%. Okay, Lisbeth, you are a massive threat and you have a lot of health. You're probably going to go for Alani. I'm going to do what I can. I'm hoping you don't. Alright, shoot Lizbeth. You're going to head to here. Put that in. I don't know who you're going for. But at least you're getting shot. Willpower, not good. Okay, Argoon. Fine, I'm fine with that. Fly, you can engage. Please do. Okay, destabilizing strike. Give him a slice. And weaken him with a taunt. Free counter. But you're still engaged. Alright. Argoon, your turn. Head on in. Attack from this side. Go with a wham. And with a bam. Okay, Falai is in a lot of trouble. She's probably about to go. You, fortunately, can get a shot in. Burn him. Beheadite Sanction. Must be engaged in combat at the end of the round. She's about to do an attack on Fly, which is going to free her. Can't do that. Let's just... Someone is gonna go. I don't know who, but we can get as much damage on her as we can. Alarin. Okay. That's fine. Alarin's gone. Fly is still in. They're almost dead. Okay, we got that guy in again. But, Fly, you can finish him off. Uh, use one of these. Use a slice. Oh, right, they heal up at the end of the round. Galvanize troops. Oh, must end their turn next to an ally. I forgot about that. But, that helped out. And you're gone. However, we can finish you off. You can do a wham. And they're gone. Un oh no, that's it. 
Most contestants we got it. Get past Kogo and Toro. <laughs> you definitely deserve your award. Huzzah! You can continue challenging the fourth league champions, who now know how you fight. As soon as your reputation increases enough, I will summon the third league. Huzzah! You've received a letter bearing the Arena of Legend seal. You can now challenge the third league's champions. Huzzah! Gladiator and recklessness. Excellent. And we're almost famous again. And I think... Yep, that all didn't track in. So what is this new item? This shield belonged to a knight clad in gold from head to toe. Level 4 shield. Deals an amount of damage to the target and applies vulnerability to all enemies adjacent to the target. Honestly, it's really not that good a shield. At least not in my opinion. Especially because you gotta spend all that effort to improve it. The third league champions await. I don't want to spoil the surprise, but you're in for a tough fight this time. So, who do we have for this one? Okay, that gets... Trevetta's Gambeson and Trevetta's Spangenhelm. This one gets Lisbeth's waistcoat and Lisbeth's beret. Why is every reward level 4? Rod left hands gloved. This unit deals 30% extra damage with thrown items. Not that good. Trevetta. Didn't we already deal with her? Enemy units gain the rage status when they're burning. Nyrolf and Essela, every time an enemy unit deals a critical hit, an enemy animal launches an attack of opportunity if possible. And Kirkshed, at the start of the second round, a snow bear is released into the arena. Oh! That's interesting. Okay, so we don't want to burn them. That wouldn't be a good thing. Damage to units in the area and then lights them on fire. So that's going to happen easily. You have... You have Sleuth. Okay, so that's why you're allied to the bear. Who is very powerful. Very tough. That'll be a, a problem. And then we've got Kirkshed, who... Damage the target. Increase for each bonus and debuff applied to the target and this unit. Ooh, that's risky. And a lot of army. Uh, armor. Okay, um... We might be able to do it. But I'm going to drop down a save first. Alright, this episode is probably going to go a bit long, but I want to see if we can handle this. I'm going to do the same group again. Let's see how we do. Fly must not move. Honestly, considering requirements don't cause problems, she's still going to. Lauren, shoot Trevetta. Trevetta is going to be ble burning, but that's fine. Alright, Fly, you are going to move. Head on over. Now that I think about it, she could have done intervention. No worries. Alright, one of those. Free attack, and another attack, and give a taunt. Thank you for the free attack. Haven't really done too much yet, but you are about to do an infused axe fly. Cannot burn! Alright, you, head on over to here. Go with a wham. And with a bam. Very nice. Now fall back. And you... Go ahead in. Stab him. And honestly, I think that's fine. Fly will be perfectly fine, I think. Yep, Fly is fine on that hit. Good. And took a lot of damage. Alarin must not take any damage. Well, that's going to be fine. You can go ahead, give another stabbing. And, in fact, fall out, toss in a smoke screen. Free attack. Fly, go ahead. You're engaged again. And a stabbing. 
And we got him. Trivita, Trivetta's down. Every time an enemy unit deals a critical hit, enemy animal deals an attack. Okay. This one is going to be tricky. Not going to bother with the requirement, but... Hmm. He's not going to move, he's just going to get the bear going after someone. I could send you in to get the attention of the two and do a load of damage, but I think the first thing we need to do... You know... If I set up a proper shot... No, it's not gonna it's not gonna be the best. Aim Shoot an eye rolf. That'll have to do. Nyrolf actually moved. I'm actually kind of surprised. Which means Escilla is going to go for him. Okay. All right, you are going to do this, and this. And a taunt. Tiny amount of damage and you are taking hit. All right, our goon is going to be attacked by a Scylla who is very powerful. But can't actually reach our goon in one go. Alright, I'm gonna make a try here. You are going to head over here. Give a stab. A lot of damage. Yacht 179. Give a burning. Alright, I think Falai can finish that one off. Good! Nyrolf, you're gone! So, Asilla, where are you gonna go? You're not doing anything! That's interesting. Wham! So, is Nasilla not gonna do anything without the pheromones? That's interesting. All companions must move. Okay. Fly, you go ahead, get the bear's attention. I don't think it has any guard, but you may as well do that anyway. There's a slash. Taunt him. Ah, right! He does a knockback! Okay, you can go in. I'm fine with you doing a wham-bam, thank you, ma'am. There we go. Now, Alani, head on over to here. Give a stab. Fall back. And a smoke screen, give a free attack in. I could have done with a burning. Ow! Okay, our goon's in a lot of trouble. But we can finish him off. There we go. Escilla is down. Start of the second round, a snow bear is released into the arena. Okay. That was the second round. How tough is a snow bear? 304. That's honestly not that bad. And he can't actually reach anyone. Uh. 
I got an idea. Uh, fire a shot at Kirkshed. I'm not worried about the bear, but he's going to need to come at us. So set this up. It's charging over, and... Free shot, and he's burning, and that counted as a crit. Fantastic. All right, fly, go on in, get him engaged. Down goes your guard. In goes a slice. And in goes a taunt. Nice. There we go. Our goon is going to be in trouble, no matter what. But, you can go ahead in. Wham. Bam. And you're going to have to fall back. Still took damage. You'll be fine. Another counter. Perfect. And Alani. Go with a torch strike. That's your last torch attack, isn't it? That's concerning. I'll need to get you a new one. And leave Kirkshed alone. And he is out of armor. Perfect. Each companion must end their turn next to an ally. I don't overly care. Okay, then. Let's see. You are going to once again take care of that. Ow! I don't know how you got that, but smack him. Massive hit. And a taunt to ensure he's not going anywhere. Ow, but counter. And I think we can finish this off. Oh, no, another attack, which is a counter. Alani, you can finish him off. Beheadite sanction. He's done. Beautiful! And with that, the Arena of Champions is done. I guess it wasn't that tough for you, eh? Take your reward. No one can deny you earned this victory. Thank you. I don't care about it that much. I hope Alicia will get over it. She looked really down. Or maybe you could fight her again to cheer her up. Ah, we can go for the second league. Time to get serious, mercenaries. The second and first leagues are on a whole other level. Are you well prepared? I'm curious what it is. Nightmarish rats. So we've got Smot again. Plagued rats are unleashed into the arena at the end of each turn. Eep. Enemy animals apply vulnerability every time they engage. Eep. And Kogo and Toro again. At the end of each round, all enemy units are healed up to the level of their ally with the highest remaining health. That is a little concerning, considering it's Kogo and Toro. And they're tough to hit. Okay. Helm of Legends, as long as an enemy is adjacent to this unit, they are intimidated. Damage taken increased by 20%. Ooh. That's actually a very, very good helm. And that gives Nyrolf's cloak and Nyrolf's headband, which I don't care about. Okay. Nightmarish Rats, that's... That's going to be a rough one. We're going to be dealing with a lot of plagued rats, which I don't like that idea. Nyrolf and Asilla we can deal with. Smot is not much of a problem. Kogu and Toro. With that last thing, that's going to be very tricky. Hmm. Anyway. I am going to have to stand. I'm going to have to end this episode here. Let me just make sure Alani is still wielding a... Yep, still wheeling a torch. That's perfectly fine, and we still have a ton of torches. Also, we got paths here. Gladiator again. All right. We actually need to rest, so we'll do that in the next episode. Till then, I am Chester44. I'll send in his fly. That is Alarn, Alani, Argon, Gerlin, Hackert, Rufus, Ostingon, Burnmauer, Deekle, Kalen, Cass, Adelolt, Nelligret, Illinev, and me. This has been a Let's Play of War Tales. 
and I shall see you all next time.